Hello everyone. Uh, I'm Zhongmi Wu, and I'm gonna record the solution for question number eight in homework seven uh, for the course uh, probability and stochastic processes. So uh, the question uh, basically uh, introduced the Poisson processes to us. So the Poisson processes is defined as uh, P n t one uh, t two equals to k, and this function is equal to e to the power of uh, negative lambda times t times uh, lambda t to the power of uh, k divided by uh, k factorial. So, uh, and the uh, function will look like this down here. So for question number a, it asks us to find the uh, e uh, x t. So since uh, we will learn the Poisson function before, so uh, we already have that uh, sigma square uh, equals to uh, the e value of uh, x minus n square, which equals to uh, uh, e value of x square uh, minus n square. So uh, this also equals to uh, x uh, e value of x square minus lambda square. And this part, uh, e of x square is equals to uh, 1 plus lambda times lambda. And this part, uh, we keep this part right here so it's minus lambs, uh, lambda square so uh, this part is equal to uh, lambda plus lambda square minus lambda square so the final answer the final result will be lambda so um, the the e value of uh, xt will be equal to uh, lambda times t so for uh, question number b <coughs> it asks us to find the R T one T two. So uh, so R T one T two is equals to uh, e value of X T one times X T two, and uh, so uh, this will this will be equals to um, e uh, this part or equals to uh, e, e e of e value of uh, X T one. Uh, times x t two minus x t one plus x t one. So this is under the condition that t uh, one less than t two, so that we can use t two minus uh, t one. So this will uh, also be equals to uh, e value of x t one times e value of uh, x t two minus x t one, and plus uh, e x t one square. So uh, substitute the value uh, we found in question number A into this equation, we can get that uh, lambda t1, uh, this will be equal to lambda t1 times lambda t2 minus lambda t1 plus 1 plus lambda t1 times uh, lambda t1. So uh, this equation will be equal to uh, lambda times uh, t1 plus lambda t1 t2. So since uh, in this condition is t1 uh, less than or equals to t2, but uh, in this condition t1 is larger than or equals to t2, so this part will be equals to xt1 minus xt2 uh, plus, uh, so xt2 will be right here, xt1 minus xt2 plus xt2. So the final result will not look like this, it will be like this, so it's, it will be uh, lambda t2 plus lambda t1 times t2. So uh, by looking at these two uh, result here, so we can find the only difference is right here. So in this condition, so when t1 is less than t2, uh, the final value is right here is t1. So for this condition, t1 is larger than t2, the final uh, result will be t2 related to t2 right here so we can substitute the first part of this uh, result as uh, minimum value of t1 t2 plus lambda times t1 t2 times the lambda so this will be the final answer for rt1 t2 and thanks for watching